Hey, what's going on guys? Minecraft Tutorial here and welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make a 1.8.6 Minecraft server. So yeah, just note that Minecraft 1.8.6 just came out and for the past few days, I've um, been busy and I haven't touched my computer like for literally a week so far. I don't know why my computer kept stuffing up or I was just busy and if I had like a little bit of time, it wouldn't like... Say if I have like 20 minutes, like I, sometimes it, the video takes more time to edit and stuff like that. So which is why now it just takes me like not that long. Um, and actually, which is why I don't bother making videos, but I'm back. So yeah, so Minecraft 1.6, uh, 1.8.6 came out. So I'm here to make a, a Minecraft server tutorial. Anyways, um, so we're going to start by going to Google. Once we're on Google, we can either type in minecraft.net and it will bring us to a page like this. You can either click download and it will bring us to a page like this. Sorry guys, my Java came up or something like that. I don't know what the, that is. Or we can either go to um, Google once again and then type in minecraft.net slash download, which quickly brings us to the downloads page. So... So once you're on this downloads page, um, you're gonna wanna go scroll down and then until you see multiplayer server, we're gonna click the Minecraft underscore 1.8.6 um, exe. So we're gonna click that, and then it's gonna bring us to a page. Well, not really, but this little thing should pop up. Um, so we're gonna press save. So I will, guys, I will be right back once this loads. Okay guys, I'm back. So once it downloads for you or it's still downloading, you can go ahead, leave your computer on and watch um, a, a YouTube video. But I just sat there watching um, YouTube on my laptop, but I usually don't do that unless my iPad is broken or anything like that. So, um, so yeah, so once it completes, um, if you have Norton like I have, it should say it's safe. And um, yeah, I will leave this, um, what's it called? This uh, website in the description, or the download version, or the normal Minecraft version, or where it's like this, I'll show you right now. So you just type in Minecraft.net, and then a normal page like this comes up. So I'll leave that page and the download uh, page in the, in the description below. So yeah, so you can check both of them out, or just check this one out. So once the Minecraft 1.8.6 download has completed, we can press open folder. And it will be in our downloads folder. So what we can go ahead and do is exit out of this and then drag it to our desktop. And now we can make a normal folder. So let's just make a folder and name set and um, name it MC underscore. So, there we go. Random name. So we drag this 1.8.6 Minecraft server in there. And then we open this folder up and then open this. And then um, the full um, thingy, so there should be um, a folder, a uh, text document, uh, the Minecraft 1.8, 1.8.6, uh, and then the sh just the notepad about the, no the notepad about the server. So what we can go ahead and do is open up the notepad. What you can do now is actually um, what's it called? Right click and then press open with, and then if you don't have notepad. Find a video on how to download Notepad from the internet or something, and then so you're gonna get a press keep uh, use Notepad or whatever. You just press it, and then there we go. But first, it's not nothing showing up because we have to double click this uh, text document right here. So we double click it, and then this should be false. You change it to true, and then we can either press Control X or File Save, and then yeah. So once you've done that, you can open the Minecraft underscore 1.8.6 server. So we can do that. And then you'll see everything here has started. And sorry about that. Um, so yeah, everything is loaded. So now what we can go ahead and do is click this little thing right here and press STOP, which stands for stop. And then you give it a little bit of time. It's going to stop. So yeah, okay. So once it stops, all right. Okay, I got twenty uh, two days left. I'm gonna have to block that out. But once it stops, um, now what we can go ahead and do is go on the server properties, and then uh, here we can pretty much 
set everything. So OP permission, leave that as as four. Allow Nether if you want to go to the Nether or not. Um, resource pack hash, leave that. Level name world, we can either name the world whatever we want. Um, enable quarry, don't do that. Allow flight, so pretty much allow people that fly. Mine is set to false. So um, yeah, announce play achievements, which which is pretty much every time. Say if you go in your inventory, it should say achievements. So I'm just gonna do that as false server port leave that as 25565 or whatever yours is max world size leave that as it is um the world leave it as default i don't know what that is the level seed if you, if you want to put a seed in there which i'm not going to do force game mode leave that alone server ip leave that alone once again network comprehension three holds i don't know what that is um spawn npcs which is pretty much like i don't know if there's npcs anyways white white list so this pretty much is to have one of your friends like you put so this is the whitelist folder right here you put your friends in there so you can right click and press open with and then notepad and then you could put your friends minecraft names in there and then it should say um so yeah so what's it called um spawn animals if you want animals to spawn uh, i'm just gonna set that to false right now um hardcore leave that snooper leave that Online mode true, leave that so people can come on. Resource pack, PvP, if you want PvP. Um, enable command block, I'm going to set that as true. Uh, true, there we go. Um, game mode, leave that as zero. Max players, I always set mine to five. Leave this player idle, which is pretty much if you like BAFK for too long, you'll never get kicked. Max time, uh, spawn monsters, I'm just going to set that to false. Uh, generate structures leave that view distance leave that too and then this is pretty much where you name your minecraft um server so i'm just gonna name my a uh, minecraft no i just name it what i name my folder which is um sorry which is crap sorry okay which is um mc underscore server 1.8.6 so let's name it that and then we can click uh, control s which is to save or file save so once you do that we can open up our minecraft so let's do that real quick because i haven't been in minecraft for a long time now um so and we can also open up our uh minecraft server so once we open it up we can get out of this and get out of that and then um sorry about that guys i will have to block all of that out okay now we're gonna press play okay so we're gonna go to multiplayer and then um so whatever you called your mc server i named mine mc underscore server 1.8.6 but what you're gonna need to do is uh you can either direct connect or add server so um so once you direct connect or add server you can um type in uh, as you can see local host i will quickly select the server and press edit and then you can write local host and then you can join server which is why I'll make my Minecraft a little bit bigger. Okay, I still got my skin and everything because my internet was down for a couple of days. And then now what we can do is pretty much um, go back into the server and then we can write in our, op our Minecraft name. My, my Minecraft name is right there. So we can type in uh, 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 OP. Sorry guys, I forgot to leave that. OP and then underscore rtu2z and then once we do that it should say sorry once we do that it should say opt minecraft underscore which is pretty much me so now i can go in game mode one and i can pretty much get like diamonds and stuff like that so diamonds and then i could do pretty much everything yay Woo. anyways um i hope this um what's it called video helped you and if it did please drop a like button um so before i end the video you're gonna need to press stop to stop your server 
And then, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe for more, and tell me what you want to see next. And also, one more thing. It's, um, I haven't been on my computer. I've told you that, like, three or four times now. Um, for a long time. So, I don't know how really the Minecraft, uh, um, fan art video is going to turn out. So, yeah, so, yeah, thank you for watching. Please leave a thumbs up. Tell me which act line you would like to see next or just tell me not to like make any more because they're kind of the same until I get into the Minecraft and tell you which button I press to open the GUI or whatever it's called. So yeah, thank you once again. Enjoy. Peace.